Today we are about to learn two examples of broadcast broadcast receiver. And first, we will create a broadcast receiver without using any external app. And in second, we will create a broadcast receiver inside a background service. How to use it in the video came from a website. You can visit them and copy the code or type it manually. In your project on create, add true ASD blocks. Our variable receiver is a new broadcast receiver. Code placed inside it at onReceive method will be executed when we receive an intent. After that, we have intent filter. Specify the action to which receiver will listen to. Operating system generates various broadcast intents. We will catch connectivity change. So we will get notified when our internet connection is connected or disconnected or reset. You can also catch your custom intents or any other system generated intent like boot completed time zone changed internet connection accessibility changed usb device attached or media mounted outside main activity we have to declare broadcast receiver and intent filter make sure to unregister receiver when you don't need them so we will do it at on destroy We will unregister only if receiver is not equal to null, otherwise it will send an exception. Let's run the project. We have... We are listening to connectivity change. So whenever internet is connected or disconnected, we get notified. I assume you already have a service in which you want to add broadcast receiver. If you don't have, you can simply learn from YouTube. I have placed a link of video in description. And if you don't know how to use XML Editor Pro, you can learn it from my previous video. Here I have exact same code that we have used at a start of the video. Simply select all, copy and paste it in the service at a suitable place. In XML Editor Pro we can paste only most recent copied code. So paste your code again and copy it. We will unregister receiver if it is not null at on destroy. Just to make it clear, I just I want to tell that I have made only two changes uh, using XML editor. First, I have added service and uh, manifest, and second, our entire BG service dot Java class is added using XML editor. So let's proceed injecting the code and compile the project. We have a distraction here. I want to remove the code that generates notification and toast. And just want to leave our broadcast receiver. You can place as much code as you want. Now our service works just as expected. 
when we start the service we get notified and then whenever network state is changed we again get notified once we stop the service we won't get notified anymore see you next video till then bye bye take care and allah hafiz